Porsche will build only 500 copies of the 911 Turbo S exclusive globally. Exclusive, it's right there in the name. Actually, the exclusive part of the name refers to Porsche's in-house customizing department, exclusive manufacture, a label emblazoned on the fender badges. These are the folks made famous by their willingness to wrap anything and everything in leather. Want your tires to be wrapped in hides? They'll probably do that. Highs out as your buddy's Turbo S, carbon fiber everywhere. Lows it's a quarter million bucks and still looks like just another 911 to your neighbor. While they're renowned for their skills in the bovine skin arts, the exclusive department also does engine work. The Turbo S exclusive is a showcase of everything that the factory will do to a 911 Turbo S. Pushing power past 600 ponies and extra 27 horsepower over the standard Turbo S pushes the exclusive to 607 ponies. If that makes it quicker, it's difficult to tell from the driver's seat. Acceleration is brutally quick, but a regular 911 Turbo S is already among the quickest cars we've tested and the power gain is less than 5%. Porsche's own numbers put the exclusive ahead of the regular Turbo S by only 0.3 second to 124 miles per hour and the claim top speed is identical at 205 miles per hour the company says that 0 to 60 miles per hour comes up in 2.8 seconds using the standard sport chrono packages launch control matching porsche's claim for the standard turbo s we've recorded 2.6 for that model these aren't differences that make themselves evident in your daily commute and we couldn't feel much difference even while lapping the exclusive at Thunder Hill Raceway Park in Northern California. Then again, this Biolip Zero equipped car had little trouble keeping up with the new 4.0 liter 911 GT3 running on stickier Michelin Pilot Sport Cup 2 tires. Like the Turbo S, the exclusive is willing and eager on track. It'll rotate if you provoke the rear end with the throttle, it has brakes but never give up and the washing six behind the rear seats figuratively shortens straightaways even if the extra punch isn't obvious without a stopwatch. Adding lightness visual differences are more obvious. Stripes of exposed carbon fiber are a tip off that the roof and the hood are indeed composed of carbon fiber. The characteristic weave is on display all over the car, from the spoiler to the mirrors. The theme continues inside with multicolor carbon fiber instrument panel trim. Believe it or not, at its $258,550 price of entry, the Turbo S exclusive isn't fully loaded. There are still a few standalone options available to further personalize this already rare car, including an audio system upgrade and leather covering for the fuse box. It appears Porsche is making this ultimate and rear 911 to test the quarter million dollar waters, while undeniably cool. The Turbo S exclusive will appeal to the Porsche faithful who especially prize rarity. The rest of us could be more than satisfied with the $191,750 Turbo S or even the 540 horsepower Turbo for $162,850.